Hello everyone. Finally, I added physics to my train. Here you can see the part which are in green are the part which has physics in them. And as you can see, as I go forward into my train, physics automatically will be added and deleted. In these days, I also change a lot of other things in my train. For example, height map is now a 32-bit floating point. Yeah, after a lot of testing, I decided to not use half floating point. One important reason is that half floating point did not give me the accurate result which I expected. Other reason is that the height map collision shape in Godot also used 32-bit floating point, and if I use this data type, we do not need to convert our height map to create collision shape, and this save a lot of processing power. Also, I created a train texture importer. Here, if I go to project tools, you can see end train importer here is added. If I click on that, a new window will appear, which here I can import my image. For example, I select this height map, which I made that previously. And then I specify a region size here. If you follow my other video about train, you know we divided the height map to different region and this is the region size in pixel. Other thing to note is that the dimension of the train must be in the power of 2 plus 1. Also the size of the region should follow this rule. I will create another video about this and I will explain the reason behind this. After that you should enter the maximum and the minimum height here. Then just click on import. This will import the height map. You can also import any other thing related to train with this importer. I need just a little bit more time for clean this up and I will publish the alpha version of this plugin in following days. Thank you for watching. Until the next video. Bye.